All right, guys, welcome to another video. Uh, today we're doing the Ninja Plus OX uh, game controller. I got this from my iPhone 15 Pro Max. And the reason I did change from my Kishi um, Razer, I had the version one, which had the plug for the uh, lightning bolt cable on the iPhones. Uh, since I iPhone uh, changed the ports, I wasn't able to use it anymore. And they're pretty expensive, 100 bucks, so it's like I'd rather I spend a hundred bucks. It's not something I do much gaming on my phone. Usually I do it between classes when I need a distraction before my other class starts or whatever. Um, so yeah, I'm like, I'm not gonna spend a hundred bucks or something. I don't use that often, but I do like playing online Call of Duty on my phone. So this one went for $49. Really easy to use. Instruction manual tells you how to switch colors. How to turn on turbo mode. Comes with a little bag, a little pouch. And then it comes with the cable right here. As you can see, it's a new port port as well. And then uh, more labels. And I think they give you a warranty. Here you go. One-year warranty, 30-day return, 60-day replacement. Uh, website is walkscool.com. On Amazon, it says iOS 6 Ninja. The seller, I don't know. Um... I've used it a couple a couple times already, maybe almost a week. I like it so far, and what I like about it, I'm gonna stretch. Might be able to fit an iPad Mini on there. I'm not sure. What I like about it is that it doesn't have a port. It has this rubberized grip right here. So you can stick your phone in it, um, and you turn it on like so. There you go. Oh, and it vibrates, which my uh, other one, my Virgin one. Um, Razor Kishi didn't do. You can change the colors. This is the back. It's rechargeable right here. And it operates through Bluetooth. I thought there was going to be a lag, which kind of, I was kind of not looking forward to it. But honestly, it's, it's, there's no difference. So that's pretty cool. Um, you can go to turbo mode by holding turbo up. It just basically raises the burst fire. <laughs> so, you know, you really want to win in Call of Duty. <laughs> Put that turbo mode on, and you know, I think it shoots up to 15 bullets per second, something like that. The firing rate, so you know, it's a good way to cheat. Um, it changed the colors. Ah, oh, let me see, I don't really change them. Let's see if I can remember. Yeah, oh, accidentally connected to my uh, game center because I pressed the home button, anyway. So, to activate to change the colors on here, you just hold turbo, and you press this is R3, they call it. You can see the game, the colors changing. Blue are off. Only ones that stay on are these. Um, honestly, that's it. Usually, like a regular Xbox PlayStation controller. Here's the the buttons, the triggers. So you don't get actual triggers. You get like little buttons you press. So shoot, grenades, flashbang, aim. I think it's aim. No, it's not aim. I don't know. Like I said, I haven't played it that much. But yeah, guys, I mean, honestly, it's a worth the price. 50 bucks. And then the initial connection right here. It's easy. You just press home and B. Press home and B. And then you switch on your phone for Bluetooth. But yeah, guys, I don't have another phone to try it on for you guys. I'll put the link in the description for you guys so you guys can check it out. You can see right here, if it's my iPhone 15 Pro Max, through Bluetooth, no lag. Pretty awesome. For the price, I recommend it for you guys.